Um, I think it's a, just a brilliantly fast-paced action thriller. Um, uh, but at the heart of it, there's a real gritty story. Um, Reed's done a fantastic job at making sure that the, the truth behind these characters comes to screen. Um, and I think Blake does such an extraordinary job in this movie in a, in a way that people won't necessarily expect. Um, Proctor's at quite a, a kind of a, a turning point in his life at the start of the movie. Uh, he's been a journalist for a while, but never had a story as big as this. And this is really potentially explosive for his career. I mean, this is not only a fantastic thing for him to, to reveal the information that he's found out, it also means he might win prizes as a result. So he's excited about releasing this information, getting it in the, out in the world. Um, but of course, when he meets Stephanie, he realizes that there's a human cost to this story too. And he sees what she has become. Um, and it takes him to some quite dark places. What's fascinating about the, the Proctor and Stephanie story for me, I think you realise that, that really it's, um, it's his relationship with Stephanie that, that might be a catalyst to turn Stephanie into what she becomes later in the movie. Um, at the start of the movie, there's pretty much no hope for Stephanie. And there's something about what goes on between Proctor and Stephanie that enables her to see a new way and possibly start to get clean and turn that resentment that she has into something else and turn her into the character that she becomes later in the movie. Uh, Blake is such a wonderful actress to work with. Um, uh, honestly, on, on set, when you see someone be able to kind of plumb those depths, and it's a role that people wouldn't necessarily expect the beautiful, wonderful Blake Lively to, to play. Um, um, she's not afraid of, of being totally kind of denuded in who she is as a personality on, on set, and it's, um, it's extraordinary to see, it really is. She's not, not scared of going there, which is all you can ask from, a, from a, um, someone you're acting opposite. It's such an unusual place to be on a set where a director is as interested on a movie like this, which ostensibly could be a straightforward action movie. Um, uh, it's such a treat to work with someone who wants to give it so much colour and life. Um, and together with Sean, our extraordinary DP, um, the, 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 the atmosphere that's created on this set um, what it's given to the storytelling, I think, is really wonderful. Reed is just just uh, amazing to me. I think she's going to be kind of one to watch the years to come. Not that she hasn't already been, but I think many of the most kind of loved movies of the years to come will be Reed Morano's. Um, she's she's an extraordinary director to work with. I think it's fantastic that we have pretty much an all-female team with our, our director Reed and our producer Barbara and our wonderful leading lady heading up this movie. Um, uh, what I think is really wonderful about it is that the more movies like this that are made in this way, um, the more it just becomes the norm and it's not something we even think about. Um, uh, you know, at the moment it's kind, of, uh, it's kind of something to be noted because it doesn't happen very often. But yeah, hopefully in years to come it's not even something we'll think about. Um, it'll be a great movie and stand up in its own right. It doesn't matter whether it's a man or a woman directing or producing. Um, we're all there just doing it. Yeah, our art department have done such a fantastic job on this. They really have. I mean, you know, we're so blessed here to, to be here uh, working in, uh, on, this, on this stage at the moment. And originally we were in, in Ireland doing this. Now we've recreated the, the set here in Madrid. And uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's a wonderful set to work on. It's so detailed. I mean, if you get to see in the back of some of those shots just how much detail there is in the wall about every one of those families, every, everyone who was supposed to have been on the plane, everyone has a little backstory makes my job very easy when I walk around the walls and see the research that my character is supposed to have done. Um, it's all there for me to see. And what it, what it gives us, it, it paints a picture of Proctor as someone who's been obsessed by finding out what's gone on for the past couple of years now. Hey, don't close out today with me because I have a really cool movie fact. Did you know the Hollywood star who played the most leading roles in feature films was John Wayne, who appeared in 153 movies? Now, you don't always have to have the leading roles to make records, as the star with the most screen credits is John Carradine, who had been in over 230 movies. Now, hmm, do you like my shirt? Get one for yourself in the link in the description.